I should check on Miles. Hey, Pete, you okay? That's what I was gonna ask you. I'm fine, but you and May are in the middle of it. We're busy, but people need help. And I'd rather be doing something than waiting around for somebody else to fix things, you know? Yeah, I heard that. Just make sure you protect yourself. Mask and gloves. And rest every now and then. Well, that goes double for May. <sighs> Nobody can make that woman take a break when she doesn't want to. But I'll do my best. Thanks, Miles. Give me my love, and be safe. I realize the irony in me saying this. I hope you... Take a closer look. Now, if I was a mercenary dressed like a scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! <laughs> Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you, which I respect. Damn it! What did he inject me with? Whoa! What the... Is that... a sea of poison? Can't be! This can't be real. Must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. Gotta get to higher ground, and analyze whatever he injected me with. Should be safe for a minute. I need to analyze the neurotoxin so I can create an antidote. Scorpions made some upgrades. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create nightmares that my body thinks are real. I have to create the antidote fast. First, I need a natural steroid. Extract from an Eclipta Alba plant should do the trick. ESU's greenhouse is nearby. Hope it's in season. Clipped Alba should be inside the greenhouse. There it is. Uh, 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 uh. Don't worry. Uh, uh, Where'd it go? Is this real or in my mind? 
It can be both. Doc? It's just the hallucinations intensifying. You can get through this. Doc? You sound... Like I did before the neural interface affected my mind? My obsessions were always there, but the interface allowed me to fully embrace them. I have to fix this. Fix you! Somehow! Ah, uh, Peter. Always trying to shoulder the responsibility, even when there's no hope. I can't tell you how many times unfettered optimism has kept me going. I'll miss being. There's the Eclatob. Developing a synthetic atropine. Gotta get there fast. Giant deadly scorpion tails. Lovely. Thanks, brain. Raw panic crawling up your spine. Scorpion? I have to get this number. Always asking all these interesting questions. It's not how am I calling you? Am I calling you? Maybe I'm just the feeble screams of your dying brain. Real or no, when I cure this poison, I'm coming for you, Mac! <laughs> Please talk from the little bug. Have fun chasing pink elephants. Research station. We need that atropine. Atropine's right there. Is that good? It's you, secret safe. Atropine's gone. Oh, not again. You were too late, just as you were too late to help me. This isn't you, Doc. Ah, oh, but it is me. The me polite society found in me. Parts of myself I suppressed, but you helped me break those chains. I'm sorry. I'll find a way to help you. I swear it. Stop deluding you. You never help anyone. Poison is it. You are the poison. Everyone you touch suffers. Stop running from me. Let me try. I want nothing from you. You're a man. And life. Love. Career. You bring nothing but pain. No. Stop! I'm not giving up on you! Please, just talk to me. I can help you. So you can treat me like all the rest? Containing me? Suffocating me? No. I would let my genius shine on its own. I saw you, Peter. Take it. There it is. The atropine! Mix up the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. Still with us? And nearly cured. Sorry to bust up your plans. Oh, webs, don't worry. Plenty of surprises left for you. We'll be seeing each other again real soon. Count on it.
somehow. But I'm running out of time. I need to mix the antidote. Imaginary glass jaw. Not gonna be that easy. Sure it is. Now I know you're the poison trying to distract me. Bring it on. Barely stand up. There's the equipment I need. Finally, I'm running out of time. I think I did it. Where'd my suit go? I think I took decontamination a little too far. I'd better put some clothes on. Much better. Let's just go ahead and forget that ever happened. Head's still foggy. Need to work the last of the poison out of my system before I tackle the other villains. Good time to go on patrol. Take out those snipers. MJ, hey, you mind if I toss a kind of thorny ethical question at you? When is it okay to give up on a friend? Oh, wow, Pete. Thinking of Otto? That obvious, huh? Yeah, understandable, though. Man. The high-minded, generous part of me wants to say, 
Never. Being a true friend means being there, even when people lose their way. But with what Otto's done... I just don't know, Pete. I guess you have to decide if the Otto on Pete's team is still in there or not. Maybe if he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process some stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you. I need to get after Scorpion, but I haven't seen Aunt May face to face since the fire. I think I can afford a quick pit stop. I need to get after Scorpion, but I haven't seen Aunt May face to face since the fire. I think I can afford a quick pit stop at Feast. Over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? Oh, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. 
I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Milk run. How did a bunch of convicts even do this? Looks like an exploding bulldozer went through here. I can't turn back. Beast needs those antibiotics. You hear the sound his head made when the big guy hit him? Like a bug on a windshield. Splat. All because he made one stupid crack about the guy's suit. Frickin' intense. Dude's got issues, man. Big one. Need to distract him. Hacking app should work. Time to move. Should be able to hunt that wall. <clears throat> Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. Here, Gaz. Guys like an animal. Iodine, but no antibiotics. I need to keep looking. Both of them are, but they're on our side. You two, get over here. All right, all right, already. This can stop right now. Just give us the locations and schedules for your supply points. I don't have that information. Believe me, I hate watching Benson wail on you. It turns my stomach. Just give us the More supplies over there. Need to get past these guys. Don't have clearance for that. Why are the super dudes so set on taking out these relief centers? Something about us. They want to show how weak he is and that he can't protect the city. <laughs> Sounds like a lot of drama. As long as they let us keep all the supplies behind, I don't care. Yeah, man. This stuff will be worth a fortune on the black market. Come on. Let's keep digging through it. Another supply tent. Trauma kits, but no antibiotics. Gotta be somewhere. Looks like you're up the supplies. Oh boy. You better not try to short us. Hey, you gotta, gotta avoid that sniper. Bro, relax. Everybody gets a tank. Nobody's trying to short. Dude, Exploding bulldozer. Supply routes and schedule. Now! Just as out! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is. inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! <gasps> Not need to see that. What was that? Check it. Now. Don't think he saw me. Time to get out of here. Right. 
opening. Let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha, <laughs> kids right. got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. I gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. 
Stick close to feet. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Yuri, figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired, but hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith. This is Stable Control. Need a status update on Gramercy. Control. We've located the fugitives and are in pursuit. Hey, MJ, what's up? You okay? I'm fine. Coming through Oscorp records. Hey, this is random, but do you remember that trip we took to Staten Island with Harry? To find the best pizza in the city? Yeah. Ten-hour odyssey for burnt toast with cold American cheese. How could I forget? Something about all these old Oscorp files made that day pop into my head. Harry was so excited about riding the ferry. Just made me think about how much simpler things were back then. No jobs, no super villains. You throw away a whole day looking for bad pizza just cuz. Now it feels like if we take a nap, the world will fall apart. Yeah, this adult thing is rough. But I guess the work we do means today's kids can have their own Staten Island adventures. In safety. Kind of a circle of life thing. Circle of bad pizza. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Thanks, Pete. Lost them. Hope they don't ruin any farmers markets or outdoor yoga classes. 1051. Escape prisoners and vehicles are causing a major disturbance. Officers needed. Atlantic Hill. Over. Never finished this application for the coffee bean. Would have paid more than what I'm doing now.
close to perfection. You're pulling your punches. Been criminals. I don't need to kill them. Never hold back. I won't. This guy's got issues. By the beat down, die by the beat down. Attention, stable teams. Need immediate sit rep on the status in Bloomingdale. Checkpoint secure. Be advised. Region highly kinetic. There is no one my size, folk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Ryan, we'll keep the team up. Thought you were alone. Ah, means an end, folk. All of nightly means an end. So what's the end for these particular means? Freedom! True freedom! No more suit! No more rhino! Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't show you? Beg him to give up? Yes, Gargan, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. Come down and help me, bro! 
Absorb that particular lesson. Thanks. Do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Didn't I hear you took a poetry yes, class in the raft? Freak like show. a therapy thing? Ah. Ah. A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready.
Alarm. Paranoid. Conspiracy. All nasty words people have used to insult and demean me. But now, after years of me trying to warn you all, here we are. Spider-Man has literally brought a plague down upon us. Why do I blame him and not Martin Lee? I do blame Martin Lee. He deserves swift justice, but he's a lunatic terrorist. This is what they do. Whereas Spider-Man claims to be a hero. Yet he obviously knew about the threat and didn't warn us. He either thought he'd handled it, which makes him criminally negligent, or he was in on it, which makes him a terrorist too. 